to shine a light on the natural beauty of winter this season is our warm and cozy Paige. Oh, that's right. Hey, Paige. I actually like you in this chair. Can you just do the entire segment from there? I'll be here. You it's let me know how we just make giving this amazing support. DIY. Yes. Well, I you know I love winter, and I actually after yesterday we learned all you know how to make your house wonderful. This could help adding light and adding the the outdoors, bringing it inside and making something beautiful of something that actually exists outside. I love the way it looks, and That's you're going to show me how to make it. I have to get up. And and what I love is that no matter what kind of sticks you get, it's yeah. going to be different. Yeah, it's going to be different Do wherever you are in the country or wherever you get these wonderful little sticks. Like if you're in your driftwood. backyard and you collect little sticks yes. around, it'll be uh, more even personal to you. Now, exactly. In order to get started, I understand obviously we've got a cord for the light, right? Which means underneath it, we got to have a little space, we right? We have a little space. So we start with a wood slice. Well, you actually start with your light. Okay. I think we reverse engineer from our light. So the light that I got, we want to make sure that there's enough room in the wood slice okay. to accommodate that. Yep. Um, and then you see this. Um, measurement right here. We want to make sure the legs are going to make sure that this little cord, even if it's turned that way, we I need see. enough room okay. to make that happen. So that's sort of the defining dimension. Right exactly. Okay. Yep. So it's going to change for wherever you get this. Right. Okay. So the first thing we wanted to do, um, I took a Forstner bit um, and cut a hole in this. So I did this outside. Um, best to do that outside. And then it's a little messy. It's a little messy. Um, then turn it over. These are where we're going to add our little legs. So and then this gotcha. is all also. It's dependent on what size dowel you want to use. So whatever size you want, make sure that your Forstner bit matches up or it's just a smidge bigger so that we can put these in. And whatever cord size, same idea with that Forstner. Exactly. Okay, good. So we do that. And yep. we, I'm going to take this guy out of the way? Yes, please. Okie dokie. Okay. So you can see when you do drill the holes too, no wood slice is the same either because it's okay. actually coming from a tree. So it's a little oblong. So you want to make sure that um, that doesn't matter. It just makes sure that you you want to make sure that all four legs are on the same kind of kind of area and path, so it doesn't have a little hitch and it's giddy up. Yeah, I'm gonna right. put this in. Okay. Uh, with just a mallet. No um, wood glue needed for that. No, you can definitely add it, okay. but um, I didn't add it this time. Also, I want to back up a step. Sure. Do you see this um, piece of paper or piece of tape I have on yeah. this Forstner bit? Yeah. That was to make sure that I didn't go all the way through my piece of wood. So you can see that I was drilling, drilling, drilling. I stopped when I got to the blue tape and that made it um, equal on all four I was just gonna legs. say that's another way to make sure all four legs are gonna be pretty darn close. Exactly, yep. Same height and boom, you, there you go. You, you, you can little... use it as a stool, obviously, right there. Very nice. Then you're done. Um, but this is, you wanna add your light okay. um, fixture there. So, and your light bulb's gonna go in the top. We're gonna turn this back over okay. and we're gonna secure this to the wood. Gotcha. Um, I'll have you put on your safety glasses. Absolutely. For me, please. Okay, now I'm just taking tiny little screws. We don't need a lot here because mainly the weight of Thank you. Um, the weight of the light bulb on the other side is actually going to do most of the work. We're just kind of holding it into place. Fantastic. So you could go crazy and do all six screws. I'm just gonna do two, that'll lock it in. I really do love the, the feel of this. It's almost like, I mean, I know everybody's sticks will be a little bit different depending on where yep. you're in the country, but this has got a really nice Scandinavian look and feel it to does, it, doesn't it? Yeah. It does, but yes, it would also be really cool if you used a darker wood. Okay. But just depending on what you've got. Okay, so Absolutely. you wanna make sure, because this is your time before you start adding the, the sticks, this is your time to make sure all of that works. Okay, we're all good to go. We're two oh, thumbs up. This yep. next part is my favorite part. It, it's so much fun, yeah. yes. Okay, well, well, is it adding the light bulb? Well, or adding the sticks? The sticks. <laughs> Did I jump ahead? Okay, you got no, a cool light bulb in here. It's a really cool light bulb, and it kind of gives um, a warm effect like a fire. And if you could grab the, yeah. the gun, okay. I'll grab the sticks. You got it. Um, and I'm getting caught up. These look like long ramen noodles, don't they? Let me help. Thank you. Thank you, Cameron. Okay. All right, yes, no one said this was not a sticky business here. Okay, what you wanna do is take the ratio of long to short and the width. You wanna make sure you have something different going all the way around. Okay. You also wanna make sure in the back, I love these like crazy sticks, you actually leave a little place for your hand to get in and oh, undo the light bulb. That's a pet peeve of mine. Yes, so nice. I mean, you could probably reach in all the way at the top, but if you leave just a little, look at that, you can go right in. Okay, okay so I'm gonna start with this one. Um, put my glasses back on, put your glasses back on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm taking this. Yep. If you could hold this in place for me. Sure. I am going to, you know, I think you would think that you'd want to start up here, yep. but you actually want to start all the way down at the base and then it kind of disappears. Okay. So we want to make sure it's there. So, so you cover up the base too. Exactly, yep. Um, if you could put, give me some resistance sure. back. Thank you. There we go. And you have to do two. You can't do one. 
So if you only do one, you'll have tilt. Yeah, it'll hinge. Yep. So all the way around, you can keep doing this. Okay. Then um, add the the small ones, add the tall ones. Go all the way around. Make sure that you have two in every one. Okay. Um, and then you can uh, turn on the light. Why don't we get a little look see at what it looks like with the lights off mm, in let's the do dark? It. Here's another look. There you go. Oh, you see? Check it out. <laughs> Full instructions, hallmarkchannel.com.